Hey y'all, Gregor here with a brand new video. This time we're going over an Affliction deck that I used to hit Infinite this season. This has been doing well even with the changes to Hella, so I want to share it with y'all. This deck is a little bit different than the one you probably see a lot on Ladder. I choose to run Symbiote Spider-Man over Shang-Chi, and I think it gives us better results. This deck does well even in the current Hella meta that we're in. If you haven't, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, do all the things so the algorithm posts the video to more people so they have a chance to see it. Thank y'all for watching. I hope you enjoy the deck. So as usual, I like to highlight some of the cards that are really kind of the backbone of the deck. I feel like high Evo is very much needed, even though it only is affecting two cards. High Evo is only affecting Abomination and Cyclops in this list. He does a ton of work with those two cards. Cyclops is so helpful putting down the two extra damage, and then you get Abomination for basically zero at the end of the game. Just really, really solid also. Extra points for Hazmat as well. Hazmat and Ajax, they combo so well together. Yeah, those are some of the cards that you will be needing in this deck. Let's go over the actual list. So this is Sable's Evo. This deck runs Silver Sable, Hazmat, Scorpion, US Agent, Cassandra Nova, Rogue, Cyclops, High Evo, Man-Thing, Symbiote, Spider-Man, Ajax, and Abomination. The cards that I would say are hard requirements in this deck would be Hazmat, Scorpion, Cyclops, High Evo, and Abomination. You can kind of work with the other cards. I would prefer that you had Ajax in this list. Also, US Agent and Man Thing. Also, really, really great. And Cassandra Nova is just a really awesome counter to RSM, which you do see every once in a while on Ladder or in Conquest. So, as far as Rogue goes, Rogue can be Red Guardian. A lot of people run Red Guardian in this list. I chose Rogue instead just because of the amount of Luke Cage that I've been seeing in Hela and I've been playing Conquest with this deck. I prefer Rogue over Red Guardian and Conquest. That's just a personal preference, but Rogue could be Red Guardian very easily, just an easy swap out. Put my guy Red Guardian in. Other subs that you could do, as far as Symbiote Spider-Man goes, Symbiote Spider-Man is usually Shang-Chi within this specific list. I like Symbiote Spider-Man better, the reason being is that you're usually hitting your opponent with so much affliction that by the time you hit turn six, you're not gonna have a lot of cards that you can actually hit with Shang-Chi. So I figure Symbiote Spider-Man's better. Also, Symbiote Spider-Man allows you to lay down Hazmat early instead of having to hold on to it to the very end. So you can lay down Hazmat, you can put Symbiote Spider-Man, and then you get a second hit off of that later. So it's a way that you can get a second Hazmat off, or you could hit Scorpion, or you could hit Cassandra Nova. I don't recommend hitting Silver Sable because it's just very low value. Those are the three cards that you should try to target. Uh, and then Ajax and Abomination. You don't have Ajax, just go for it with another big body at five. I'm trying to think here. Who could we put in at five cost in that same spot? Same spot here. Maybe like a Darkhawk or a Blink. Blink could also work, but I mean, I guess Blink isn't giving you that much value. You're basically just swapping out a four for a five. So I don't know. You're just looking for a big body. I would probably say either Arrow, Vision, or go with Darkhawk if you don't have Ajax. And then if you don't have Symbiote Spider-Man, you could go Shang-Chi but I prefer Symbiote Spider-Man personally. Um, high Evo, big hard requirement here. Um, if you don't have Silver Sable, you could go Na Nebula, or you could go like Nightcrawler, or any of those other good one-cost cards. Hazmat's needed, Scorpion's needed. Uh, US Agent, put in a two-cost of your choice if you don't have it for Man-Thing. So get four-cost cards. If you don't have Man-Thing, maybe go for Gwenpool. I like Gwenpool at four. So there you go. Gwenpool, even maybe, I don't know. I don't know how much value you're going to get out of War Machine. I think Gwenpool gives you better value. I would go with Gwenpool personally. The way that you want to play this deck, Silver Sable on one if you can, and then you either lay down Scorpion or Hazmat, Scorpion preferably. Uh, but if you don't have another option, you could do Hazmat. US Agent you usually want to hold on to. Cassandra Nova on three if you can. The sooner you get Cassandra Nova out, the better. You want to hold on to your Red Guardian or your Rogue, depending on what your opponent has. Cyclops you can do on three, but usually you want to hold him on four. That way he gets his laser beams off. For turn four, you could do either Cyclops, you could do High Evo, Man Thing, or you could lay down the Symbiote Spider-Man. If you're laying down the Symbiote Spider-Man, like I said earlier, you want to lay down into the Hazmat, Scorpion, or Cassandra Nova lane. Turn five, you're going to play Ajax. You should have Abomination for basically nothing, so you're able to put down a lot of power last turn. And usually your opponent can't deal with that amount of power. Even if they're running something like Hela, this deck does awesome. Give it a go. Let me know what you think. My goal for next year is to come back to TwitchCon as a partner with that partner the partner badge Gotta run, hun. oh they're totally playing hella 
They're absolutely playing Hella. So we can Cassandra Nova on two, which is amazing for us. And then I think we play our US agent mid. Yeah, this is 100%. The good news is Bar With No Name is out there. So if they do Hella, there's a good chance their big cards end up going into Bar With No Name. So I'm gonna Scorpion right. We are going to Cyclops mid. It's Willy Wonka. Yeah, this is absolutely hella. Let's do Abomination. And then we do Ajax. We just need to win a single lane. Luke Cage is annoying for us. Because it kind of ruins our entire play line. We'll see how it goes. Hell is going to decide this for us. Blink was not what I was expecting. They blinked the Luke Cage? Twenty. No, we win. We win that. Victory. Very, very risky play they just made there. Okay, we have Scorpion on two. How would you balance Hella? I would make it so there's no way that those cards that get her brought back don't get the negative three. Even if they played Luke Cage. You can cancel the Luke Cage, but a lot of the times they will discard the Luke Cage and bring it back with Hella. So if that happens, you're just like, what do you what do you do there? You know? I will Red Guardian the Dazzler. Ooh, they got Wiccan. A lot of the times they won't play their Luke Cage. It will usually get discarded by something else like Hellcow or something. So I'm going to Symbiote Spider-Man here. They're playing Arashem. If we get our Cassandra Nova out, we can make a very big Cassandra Nova. Oh, that's fantastic for us. The Sorcerer Supreme. They basically clogged themselves at this point. So this is like easy snap like that's so easy to beat I mean I know they have all that extra so I'm gonna do this snap. we're gonna hit them with so much negative energy it's not even funny US agent there's one to this one so we'll get it off twice okay they legion interesting we a bomb that's actually awesome for us there's one it's going to go off again. I guess we ate the other one before it could go off. When stuff like that happens, it's confusing to... Yeah. Ajax can just chill here. I think Ajax is our best bet. They also have Ajax? We win! Their Legion screwed them over! Victory. Legion giveth, Legion taketh away. If given the option, I usually will Scorpion over... Over Sable for Symbiote. The reason I do Symbiote Spider-Man over... Shang-Chi is because usually you've done enough Affliction... To where you can't hit anything with Shang-Chi. Looks like they're just doing regular ego. I am ego. And this is my domain. I know the rules. It's snap law that you you have to snap on ego. I'm 
mount the throne. Ego knows best. Zero power Deadpool. Enough said, Bub. This is not good for them. We're winning in every lane. No? Victory. They didn't trust. They didn't snap right away. Ego can tell who is faithful and who is not. If you have Ego and have Agatha who controls the cards, I believe it's Ego. Ego is higher up than Agatha. Let's get rid of that Marvel boy. I'm gonna hit him with the Cyclops. Yep. They're gonna get hit with all the farts. Literally every fart that I have in stock. Good targets for us. One, two, and let me hit you with those. So we're both limited to what we can play because of the Sandman. Knowledge is power. Knowledge is power. They're playing Arashem. So Cassandra Nova just wins. We're gonna bait out their Shang-Chi either way. Bam. Bam. Ajax mid. We win. Doesn't do anything. Because I hit the Dakin already. And the 15 power Ajax and we call it a day. Did I tell y'all that I won at uh, TwitchCon? 
I won the Duskmorn pre-release. I went 3-0. and And I was able to get a free commander deck. My very first commander deck. It usually goes for like 70 or 80 bucks. Got it for free, but with a bunch of other stuff too. Was really, really cool. Did not expect them to have Magic the Gathering stuff. We'll do hazmat now. Yeah, it was pretty dope. The new uh, set's pretty fun. It's based off of a, like a, you're in a haunted house. I'm gonna skip because they have nothing out yet. It's fast toast. Literally the fastest toast. So we'll do symbio Spider-Man. It's a Wongers. Good news there. I was gonna red guard. I was gonna hit him with the red guardian. Bam. Bam. I think. They go for Sarah. I feel like surf. This is a surfer list, right? This feels like surfer. U.S. Agent Mid Abomination, right? I think it's the play. Abomination. Scarlet Witch was not what I was expecting. Surfer. James, are you okay? Victory. James, what was that? My cat almost fell off the computer and he was holding on the side of it like that scene from Lion King where uh, Mufasa is about to fall off the clip and he just did meow like he needed help. He got himself back up. James, that was very dramatic. He's just a little troublemaker. My creation. Ooh, Cassandra Nova at Cloning Vats is disgustingly good. For the cubes! I expect them to do another diner when Rivals launches to encourage them to keep playing Snap. Or people just miss out on the chance of getting the card, like what happened with the last Rivals. That also could happen. Yeah, the thing is, this is really mean. So I'm gonna wand the Cassandra Nova. I think we have to snap on that, if I'm being honest with y'all. What do you mean they're partnering? Elaborate. That's too many Aranyas. That's too many Aranyas. You don't need that many Aranyas. December is a rival season in Snap? That I did not know. Mm hmm Makes for a big vulture. But the only the first vulture is what goes off. So we now have a 19 power Cassandra Nova. What is their play? Why are they confident here? Question mark. Question mark. Literally hits every single one of their cards. I'm confused. Why are they so certain? But this goes off again, though. So why are they... And I can put a Kyra down. Question mark. Yeah, I don't think they did their math right. Chat, this is why you gotta do your math. You knew I had a 19 power Cassandra Nova. You knew that I would go off again, right? Show me my stats untapped. 
Okay, this is a 60.9% win rate. It still works good. This is why you gotta do your math, y'all. What did their copycat hit? Hit Cyclops. I don't think Cyclops does anything for them because they don't have high Evo. Wait, does it? Oh, it does. Oh, no. Okay, that changes things a little bit. Let me do that. Let me do that, I think. I didn't know copycat because still uh, high Evo abilities. Yo, thank you for the dolphin. 10 times dolphin? That's a lot of dolphin, bro. Thank you for the gifts. Isn't my man thing gorgeous? Look at this man thing. You want him to touch you with that. It reminds me like that's a stinky, smelly hand. The Galactus clip? Why, thank you. I appreciate that. There we go. Okay, so we could drop a hazmat. And we could drop a symbiote Spider-Man. So we're going to fart on them first. I have the full uh, video up on YouTube as well. Okay, so the fart's going down. I did activate the fart. Just put, I love playing with my man thing. Do they also have Ajax? They got Ajax too. Uh oh. Well, the good news All is systems go. We have Pryo going into this. I'm going to Red Guardian their Ajax, and then I'm going to Blue Marvel, and I'm going to call it a day. Glad you were safe. Yo, Big Robbie, thank you. It's good to be back. I missed y'all. Okay. They got Shang. Power must be controlled. They got Shang, but we still win left. And we, we, we hit him with a casserole. Basically the casserole, okay? Basi and they were cool about Victory. it. Big Robbie, thank you for your prime. I appreciate you, friend. Welcome on in. Behold my creation. Uh, and this is the deck that still does well for me. Ooh, do we do double scorpion? Double scorpion seems like a good play. And then we can simulate Spider-Man and do it again. They got Luke Cage though. But we take Pryo like this. So we hit him with a Red Guardian. I think I have Pryo. Yes, I do. Red Guardian, the Luke Cage. And then we're just going to hit him with, like, everything. Oh, snap. I feel like that's enough of a reason for me to snap. Like, they lose the... This is why you don't Luke Cage that early. You save Luke Cage. Luke Cage, you keep safe. Bam. Omega Red. Are they playing an ongoing list? Perchance. Perchance, this is an ongoing list. Okay, so I'm going to do Symbiote Spider-Man. So I can hit them again with the Scorpion. I'm very confused by what their list is. Like, I'm not even... Okay, doubles. Bam. Bam. That hits both Scorpions. And I should be able to do a Cyclops... If it was control, I would expect them to lay down the control, whatever they're controlling first. And then we have Ajax for last turn. Yeah, this is, again, Cerebro. All right, we'll wait for my lasers to go off. Hit him with the lasers. Hit him with the lasers. The lasers ruins their entire play. They got nothing. I mean, they can make their, like, they can make this guy go off. But this should also, wait, this is a four cost, right? And then we hit him with a Cassandra Nova and call it good. 
I think that's the play. I don't think we need to Ajax mid. Cool, you got a really powerful Captain Marvel. It's all going to your one Captain Marvel at this point. No, that was 100% the right call. Higher, further, faster, baby. We hit him with the casserole too. They can't do anything. Victory. No, they got absolutely annihilated. We took away their Luke Cage and they couldn't do anything. This. We'll do Silver Sable, Scorpion, then Cassandra Nova. Playing the Brooklyn Bridge. Gotta run, hun. Oh, lovely. No, okay, I'm one and two. I'm one and two. There we go. So we're gonna send me out Spider-Man Onslaught Citadel. I mean, this is looking good, but it's hella. So all they need to do is get like a good, one good play. Maybe not hella? They're running Dracula? Question mark? Big question mark? US agent, Symbio, Spider-Man, Cyclops, call it good. Hit him again. That's nasty. <laughs> Snap. <laughs> oh. Chat, am I toxic? I don't. Am I toxic? Blade hits Hulk. They got Ghost Rider. I'm coming for you. Minions to me. All good, Lufku. Victory. We got him, y'all. Made no difference whatsoever. Behold my creations. You gotta. Learning to retreat is so important in this game. I, I don't even th count it as defeat. Like, I think of retreating as not losing, you know? Like, you could stay and you could lose, or you could retreat and then come back and win more cubes. Yep. The pride is what does it. I actually have a... It's the ego. Your ego doesn't want you to retreat. Ghost Spider's interesting. I'm gonna go Scorpion, US Agent. Honestly, we have enough stuff that like won't get hit by. Simeo Spider-Man is worrisome to me. Drop Ajax there. Simeo Spider-Man makes me think they're gonna either drop, makes me think they're gonna drop Galactus. Nah, I don't like to think of retreating as losing, cause it's not. Okay, they got three. Goes to the top. Human Torch. Strange. Pulls the Human Torch. The Sorcerer Supreme. Aranya. Okay, pulls the demon. Hmm. That is a very big red guardian. I mean, we do just win. Hmm. What is the best play we could do here? This red guardian gives us insane value. 
Heimdall, show me Heimdall. Show me. Was not what I was expecting at all. I thought for sure that was Heimdall. Victory. We'll take that. We'll take that. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. We are getting even closer to our ad revenue milestone. So if you're able to watch till the end, if you made it to the end, it's super appreciated. Like we're like 500 hours away. So we'll get there before the end of the year. I believe in it. I believe in us. I should have another video Tuesday as usual, but maybe we got some more videos coming out. So thank you all for watching. Remember to, as always, eat food, drink water, take your meds, get enough sleep, and remember the world is better with you in it. Until next time, catch you later, gamers.